American actor, Henry Silva, died on September 14, at the age of 95. He was best known for his roles, as Roger Corneal, in the 1960 film, Ocean's Eleven, Chunjin, in The Manchurian Candidate, and Johnny Cool, in the film of that title. He also was a familiar presence on TV, guesting on such classic series, as The Outer Limits, Alfred Hitchcock Presents, Wagon Train, The Streets of San Francisco, The High Chaparral, and It Takes a Thief. During his 50-year career, he has appeared in more than 130 films and television series. Harry Landis, a British actor and director, whose career spanned six decades, passed away on September 14, at the age of 90. His long TV career began in 1955, appearing in the pilot episode of BBC police series, Dixon of Doc Green, in which he made subsequent appearances up to and including the finale. He was best known for his roles, as Felix Kowalski, in EastEnders, and Mr. Morris, in Friday Night Dinner. American rapper, Rakim Hashim Allen, better known by his stage name, PNB Rock, was robbed and fatally shot on September 12, at the age of 30, at Roscoe's House of Chicken and Waffles, in Los Angeles, California. He made waves at the end of the 2010s with two albums, Catch These Vibes, and Trap Star Turned Pop Star. American jazz composer, pianist, and radio personality, Ramsey Lewis, died on September 12, at the age of 87. During his career, he won three Grammys, scored seven gold records, and in 2007, was named a National Endowment of the Arts Jazz Master, the highest honor bestowed upon jazz musicians in the United States. American businessman, and the founder of Clear Channel Communications, Lowry Mays, died on September 12, at the age of 87. He was inducted into the Radio Hall of Fame in 2004. French-Swiss film director, screenwriter, and film critic, Jean-Luc Godard, passed away on September 13, at age 91. He revolutionized popular cinema in 1960, with his first feature, Breathless, and stood for years among the film world's most influential directors. During his long career, he was awarded an honorary César, in 1987, and 1998, and received an honorary Academy Award, in 2010. Welsh rugby union player, and longtime announcer for the world's strongest man, Eddie Butler, died on September 15, at the age of 65. Some strength sports fans may not know his name, but his voice is unforgettable. Revered Australian actor, musician and artist, Uncle Jack Charles, died on September 13, at the age of 79. Canadian dancer, choreographer and artistic director, Jean Renault, passed away on September 15, at age 94.